Hot, thick air will be blanketing New Hampshire over the next couple days. Today is dangerous heat. Uh, don't see this very often. It's very oppressive. Emergency crews are reminding everyone, and especially people with pre-existing medical conditions, this weather can impact your health. People that have those problems, it just exacerbates them and makes it even tougher for them to breathe. And then when they try to do something, it gets even worse. And for anyone working outside, regular breaks and hydration is key. Listen to your body. That's the most important thing. If you're sweating excessively, you feel dizzy, you feel extremely tired, take a break. Don't push it on a day like today. Very dangerous to do that. During this extreme heat, St. Anselm College's football team is getting ready for the season with morning practices under the watchful eye of athletic trainers. The biggest thing is, you know, trying to be preventative in this case and trying to, again, get these guys ready to go um, from a hydration and electrolyte standpoint. And if any of the athletes start to suffer a heat-related illness, trainers say they're ready to respond. We're going to get them in a cold, cold water immersion tub right away and try to decrease their body temperature as quickly as possible. Um, so we've got that ready to go, uh, you know, having the water about, you know, 45, 50 degrees and, and, and submerge their, their bodies in there. That cold tub sounds good right about now. And just a reminder with pets, as always, if they're in the car, make sure there's some air conditioning on. If, there's out, if they're outside, make sure they have plenty of water. And when you can, go ahead and bring them in. Live in Manchester, Jessica Miranda, WMUR News 9.